It's one of the hottest videos on YouTube right now. And up next, Craig Coffey meets the man behind Kyle Orton's farewell to Denver Broncos and shows us how this local spoof is receiving national attention. Good morning. So what do you get when you combine the drama of the Denver Broncos quarterback debate, a comedy writing actor, and the power of social media? It's a viral video explosion that's taken off over YouTube and Facebook pages both here and across the country. Now I catch up with the controversial David Lewis at Fan Sports Apparel in Castle Rock as we learn how an impression of ousted QB Kyle Orton has many reacting on his farewell to Mile High. My name's Kyle Orton, and I'm the former quarterback of the Denver Broncos. You know what I'm going to miss about Denver? Nothing. So let's talk about this now. Any backlash from Orton fans? From um, Orton people? I don't know of any Orton fans. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm actually, I actually don't mind Orton. And like, I had one lady say that she actually knows Kyle Orton. Okay. And that she thinks the video is hilarious. If I knew that all I'd have to do as a quarterback is hand off the ball, I would have just handed off the ball. All right, so the big question now, David Lewis, do people really think that you're Kyle Orton? Uh, more so than I would want to, yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> are, are they hating on you now? Um, a little bit. I'm starting to get some hatred towards me. Yeah? Yeah. I didn't expect, like, there to be political debates or okay. that sort of thing over this video, and there's a lot more Tebow fans than <laughs> I ever imagined. My dad's in a fancy football league with Tim Tebow. I guess who his quarterback is? Tim Tebow. <laughs> I'm a quarterback, Dad. I'm a quarterback. Let's talk national coverage now. This thing, like we said, blowing up here. Yeah. Uh, ESPN's contacted you. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's amazing. I had no idea. They, I guess the people from Sports Nation really enjoyed the video and they contacted me. And so we'll see what happens. Do you really have like any hatred towards Tim Tebow or no. Kyle Orton or John Elway? John Elway, I yes. As a child, be careful. I know how much you I'm say. Sorry. I don't want to say too much, but as a child, he. Um, I went to go get his autograph, and we stood in line for hours. Yeah, I was third away from getting up there, and he left <laughs> with like probably a good 15, 20 people left. And so after that, I was kind of like, I just didn't like him too much. So how does this make you feel? All this attention. It's it's amazing. I didn't. I did not. I never expected it. Okay, this thing. look right now on the camera yes. and tell all the Bronco Tebow Orton fans out there one last thing. What should they know? Um, I love you all. I'm sorry if I offended anyone. I love the city of Denver. Um, John Elway, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, did that come off fake? I don't know. <laughs> and I want you to remember this, Denver. If it wasn't for me, there'd be no Tebow. <laughs> Kyle Orton says goodbye. Uh huh. You know right what? there. He doesn't have a neck beard. You know, yeah. he, he shaved the rock and neck beard uh, oh. since making that video. But uh, uh, really he really looked like him. Though. He did cut himself. Yeah, and he says oh. that's the curse of Orton. That's uh, <laughs> coming back to. It's uh, coming after him. Yeah. Wreaks havoc. Yeah, with his hair down, though, he looks yeah. like Kyle Orton. He does. And a lot of people think so, but he's not Kyle it, Orton. He's not that guy. No, no, <laughs> no, not at all. All right, so. Only up for a couple of weeks now, already uh, exploding, taking off here over 500,000 hits. If you'd like to watch the entire Kyle Orton farewell video to Denver, you can log on to our website at coloradoconnection.com or check out the YouTube page at Fox 21 News Colorado. My name's Kyle Orton, and I'm the former quarterback of the Denver Broncos. You know what I'm going to miss about Denver? Nothing. The only good thing about Denver now is that they've recently got an Ikea. It sucks. Okay? If you're Tim Tebow, it doesn't suck. If you're John Elway, it really doesn't suck. You walk down the street and people give you quarters even though you're not even homeless. You know what John Elway reminds me of? That horse you guys have by your airport. Demon horse. I'm on to you, John Elway. I know what you're doing. I know that you have cloned Tim Tebow. John Elway, I strongly dislike you as a human being. Now I want you to check this out. My rockin' neck beard. If it wasn't for beer, I probably would have jumped off of Pike's Peak by now. If I knew that all I'd have to do as a quarterback is hand off the ball, I would have just 
handed off the ball. I'm gonna give you a little lesson, Timmy boy. This is how you throw a football. I have at least been a mile. My wife wears a Tim Tebow jersey to bed. <laughs> My wife calls out Tebow's name. My mom invites Tim Tebow over for dinner and she makes her special meatloaf. My dad's in a fancy football league with Tim Tebow. And guess who his quarterback is? Tim Tebow. <laughs> I'm a quarterback, Dad. I'm a quarterback. What is it? Tim Tebow just shows up and everyone's like, I'm gonna buy his jersey. You know, it's really hard to complete your passes. You know, I see your jersey in the stands. Nobody likes me. My son is taking a solo. And I want you to remember this, Denver. If it wasn't for me, there'd be no Tebow. I just wish in Denver they would have made a billboard for me.